Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Today I'm going to show you how to restore a firm brake pedal with one simple click. Okay, so this is a 2008 BMW 335i and the pads are probably about 50% worn. So what's typical with modern brake systems is as your pads wear down, your brake pedal has more travel before it's going to bite. And then eventually when you change out your brake pads, you get a nice firm pedal again. So typically, uh, you know, the, the calipers will adjust with time. They will squeeze in a little bit and then you'll still maintain a relatively firm brake pedal with good initial bite. But if you want to restore that really tight brake pedal as if the car has brand new fresh brakes on there with a really good initial bite, you can use a piece of software to accomplish this. So even if your pads are 50% worn, you can restore a super firm brake pedal as if you put brand new pads on there. I'm gonna show you how to do that now. So this is your dynamic stability control module or your ABS module. And what we're gonna to do today is calibrate this. So it's gonna go through a series of tests, reinitialize all the solenoids in there and adjust all the pressures so that it can actually give you a nice firm pedal and also ensure that it activates appropriately either when you need traction control or anti-lock brakes. So we're gonna use ISTA to do that. I'm gonna connect my laptop now. Grab your K plus DKN USB interface cable. Connect it to your OBD port. All right, so I got my key in the on position. We're gonna load up ISTA. I'm gonna go to operations read vehicle data, complete identification. So now you want to click on vehicle management, service functions, chassis and suspension, traction control, adjustment DSC unit. So we're going to click DSC unit adjustment, display, So it's basically saying you would do this if you replace the DSC unit, but we're doing this so that we can recalibrate it so the brakes become firm. So we hit continue. Would you like to start the adjustment routine? I'm going to zoom out here. I'm going to click on yes. We'll click on yes and you'll hear this start buzzing. Now it's telling us to wait. It's doing various adjustments, including the pressure sensor. You can hear it buzzing away. And you'll actually hear the brake pads press up against the rotors quite firmly. You can hear the brakes getting hit. As if you press really hard on your brake pedal. It's all automatic. It just goes through all tests, pressure sensors and, and whatnot. So it's done. End service function. But for me to hit the brakes that hard, I'd have to really be ramming on the pedal to be able to get the, you can hear the caliper under intense pressure. But that's what gives you a super firm pedal after you're done. You're basically telling the, the DSC unit, hey, press up against the rotors as hard as you can. And let's set that as the bite point. Even if they're 50% worn, it doesn't matter because now that you've done that, your brake pedal will instantly bite because it's recalibrated for that new position based on wear. So in my opinion, you should do this even when you've replaced your pads. But it really revives your brake pedal. It feels awesome. It makes it so that the moment you even begin to press it, you get a really hard bite. And I also retrofitted Active Cruise, and it feels like that engages a little more smoothly because it's biting a little bit quicker. So we're just going to hit continue. We're going to close out of this. There you have it guys, a relatively quick and simple way to get a firm brake pedal again using ISTA. So you should be able to find that online relatively easy if you just search for it and it's a lot easier to set up in my opinion. There's various videos on YouTube that show you how to set it up. So if you want to revive the feel of your brake pedal without spending any money, consider doing what I did in this video. 
If this is the first video you're catching of mine, consider subscribing. I do upload regularly. Thanks for watching.